I'm with uh, Laura Thurlow of the Community Foundation for Surrey at an event with uh, lots of people from Lower Green who have been part of a Nesta Neighbourhood Challenge. So what part has the Foundation played in that, uh, Laura? Um, well, we're really pleased to be able to partner with the Lower Green Community Association um, on the Neighbourhood Challenge project. Um, so we've, um, I've had quite a close involvement with Jenny and others at Lower Green and have been delighted to be involved. Um, it has, um, the clues in the name, it has been challenging, the Neighbourhood Challenge. Um, it was um, quite a tight time frame to work to um, and everything, that, everything, the way we were working was completely new in lots of ways. Um, so we were redesigning things and... Um, looking at um, doing things differently and how we could how we could do that so but within that type time frame obviously quite challenging but it was really really pleasing to be involved and um, uh, foundations are fundraising grant making bodies and you give um, grants to local groups but um, is the challenge and things that other foundations are doing giving you fresh ideas about what you might be doing in the community now yeah, very much so. I mean, obviously the work we do is we offer a bespoke service to our donors um, in terms of we manage their fund for them and enable them to give to the communities that they want to support across the county of Surrey. But it's a time where I think we're not the only foundation that's thinking how might we do that slightly differently. Um, and so it's really good to be here today to hear what Cormac's got to share with us. Yes, we've, um, we've been listening to Cormac Russell and joining in workshop. Um, activities with Cormac around asset-based community development. Further thoughts sparked by that? Um, I think it, it's been a very interesting experience. I'm looking forward to this afternoon where and we're going to unpack that a bit further and think about how we can then take this approach which we've been learning about into obviously the work that we do. Um, and I've also been talking to Matthew Bocock who's the chair of our Community Foundation Network um, who I know knows Cormac very well and has been thinking about how the network can learn from this approach. So it's ex an exciting time.